remind class 3 so we are back with welcome back module and today's chapter for revision is subject verb agreement now see children in this chapter as we did i told you few rules like when to use is am and are for example the first rule is 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 used with singular nouns or pronouns yes he is a good boy fine ram is a good doctor so is is used with singular nouns or pronouns fine r is used with plural nouns or pronouns fine we are going to jaipur they are going to market fine ram and sham are good friends so are is used with plural nouns or pronouns is is used with singular nouns or pronouns am is the best friend of i am and i they are the best friends they will always come together i am writing on the board i am teaching you okay so am is the best friend of i similarly are is the best friend of you fine you are looking very pretty you are writing in a very beautiful handwriting so these rules we need to memorize these are the golden rules that is is used with singular nouns or pronouns are is used with plural nouns or pronouns am is the best friend of i and are is the best friend of you fine now now comes the usage of was and were was and were beta again was is used with singular nouns or pronouns again okay was is used with sing singular nouns or pronouns he was in delhi yesterday i was in the market fine so with singular nouns or pronouns we will use was were is used with plural nouns or pronouns we were leaving for chandigarh Uh, uh, an hour before fine so we were leaving for chandigarh an hour before fine so were is used with plural nouns or pronouns now with i we will always use was i was in chinar public school yesterday so with i we will always use was and with you we will always use but this thing we need to memorize again fine these are the rules that we need to memorize again now comes the point where we have to use has and have okay now comes the turn of has and have again has and have dear children has and have show belongings there are many things which belong to us which belong to different people so basically has and have they show belongings here also few very simple rules are there for example has is used with again singular nouns or pronouns he has a toy car fine have have is used with plural nouns or pronouns fine we have a beautiful house in mumbai fine so have is used with plural nouns or pronouns with i we will always use have i have a beautiful suit fine with you we will always use have you have a lovely ring you have a beautiful smile fine so beta is am are was were has have these fourth these eight things basically 
they follow few golden rules which I discussed with you in this video. I also discussed with you when we were doing this chapter afresh. Fine. This thing definitely we have to keep in mind these golden rules. Okay. These golden rules we need to memorize. We need to remember very clearly so that whenever we are solving a particular exercise at that time we can apply the logic and we can write down the correct answer. In the worksheet that I will be given, giving to you in that you are supposed to use ISMR, fill in the blanks is a with ISMR or with has and have or was and was or were. Then you have to just remember these golden rules and try to apply the logic and then fill in the blanks. Although I have provided you with the answer key but you have to solve it by yourself by remembering the golden rules and then verify your answers with the answer key. Okay? Bye.